Well, drivers in St. Mary Parish are not wild about these hogs spotted on the side of Highway 90. And tonight there are safety concerns. The wild hogs have been sighted between Berwick and Bayou Vista, and some drivers are slowing down to try to catch a glimpse. And as Kendria LaFleur found out for herself, it's not hard to spot them. Here's tonight's top story. If you look closely along Highway 90 in St. Mary Parish, you'll see more than cars, but wild hogs. Hog population, it's, it's a real nuisance because uh, it doesn't take long for them to actually start breeding again. It's causing some to look twice while driving and is becoming a concern. The impact with a hog that weighs 200 pounds, you can do some devastation and possibly cause loss of, li uh, loss of life. They root up the grounds, you know, farmlands, grass, anything like that. I mean, they eat a lot of root systems and they, they dig through the mud and they use their snouts. That's what they do. It's called rooting it up. You know, so if you have a nice pretty field or a nice pretty farmland, and there are wild hogs in the area, you'll see, you know, the rooting signs. According to Wildlife and Fisheries, the chances of being attacked by a wild hog are slim. It is legal to hunt hogs, but be cautious at night. Typically, if somebody was to get harmed by a wild hog, it's some type of hunting practice, whereas, you know, people do like to bathe them with dogs and catch them and that kind of things while they're still alive or trap them. You know, you're running a risk anytime you're trapping an animal. And if you are driving, be aware and slow down, especially at night. It can tear up, you know, your natural system, eat away your roots, cause more erosion to the landscape and everything. So and generally, yeah, they are a nuisance animal. In St. Mary Parish, Kendria LaFleur, KATC TV3. Here's Eric's 24-hour forecast. Clouds and even a few sprinkles throughout the first half of our Monday.